I'm just feeling really down these days and I don't know why. Have you exercised today? No. Did you go outside? No. Did you talk to anyone? No. Did you eat well? No. Did you limit your scrolling time? No. Did you make any plans? No. Did you drink enough water? No. Did you get enough sleep? No. Wait, yes. Yes to that one. Yeah, no, it's uh, what a mystery. <laughs> well, there you go. What's going on, party people? What is going on? It's your ride share extraordinaire. Your super duper Uber driver is here, guys. That's right. That's right. Thank you. Thank you. You're far too kind. You guys already know the deal. Before you hop in my ride, do me a quick favor. Hit that like. Hit that subscribe. Poor favor. Come on. Let's do this. Hop on in. Buckle in. And let's go. Yeah! Okay, okay, party people. Welcome back and thank you for hitting that subscribe button. What are we talking about today, folks? What are we talking about today? Man, the ladies, the women in our society, we have a problem. Okay, we have a real serious problem. And it's even starting to come down to the 12, 13-year-old young girls. These young girls are addicted to Sephora, the makeup line. What? They go into the mall, shoplifting, harassing the agents, bullying their moms for some makeup. <laughs> and then when you go to the next tier, the the 18 to 24 year olds, they're addicted to BBLs. These women are dying to look beautiful. Wow. Some people cannot afford Dr. Miami. So they got to go to third world countries to get this discount procedures. You know, you go to Brazil, you get buy one, get one boob. You go to Mexico, you get buy one, get one butt. So a lot of these women are risking life and limb dying to look beautiful. And again, we don't understand why. All right. Now it's even reached to the older women. 55, I mean, 50 year olds and up. Exhibit over here. Mary J. Blige. Yes. Mary J. Blige is 53 years old and she went under the knife. Oh my God. Unbelievable. Mary J. I'm a fan of Mary J. Again, I'm an 80s baby. So I was, you know, I, I'm familiar with her music. She got a big R&B fan base. All right. When she was coming up, she did not sexualize her music. She wasn't cussing in the music. She can't dance. So she wasn't twerking. She wasn't putting her boobs out. She wasn't having no butt cheeks out. She had music. She sang her song. She had good storytelling. And again, she had a big following. So she had to do all the extra stuff. But now, 53-year-old Mary J. Blige had to go to get some BBL. For what? For this young guy that you're dating? This young actor? What are you what are you trying to tell us, Mary J? You having low self-esteem because you ain't do it for us. You do it for yourself. Is that what you're telling us? No. You tell all your fans that if a man doesn't like you for you, tell him to kick rocks. And here you go, going under a knife. For what again? Uh -huh. For whose approval? Because you don't do it for us. What are you trying to do for other women's approval? Jesus Christ, Mary J. You lost some points on that one. That's a straight L. Again, you didn't have to do that. You're not getting any... Your fan base is loyal to you. And I don't know who you're trying to impress. BBLs only attract a certain type of guy. Pookies and Ray Rays. If you're looking for that guy... They're not attracted to BBLs. And as a, you know, we've been trying to tell these young ladies, if you want Pookie and Ray Ray, yeah, knock yourself out. Get all the tattoos you want. What? Tattoo your face. Whatever. But if you're trying to get that guy who's going to provide for you, they don't want all that. They don't want all that. And it's funny that we have a lot of young moms with daughters, teenage daughters, and you tell your teenage daughters, if a guy doesn't like you for you, tell them to move on. Meanwhile, you're taking a trip to Tijuana 
to get some lip fillers in. Wow. You're going to Tijuana to putting junk in your trunk. Unbelievable. You're giving mixed messages. You're telling the ladies one thing, and meanwhile, you're doing something else. Do as I say, not what I do, huh? Mary J., who are you trying to compete with? You know, you trying to be like Megan D. Stallion? No! That hot mess? Now, you ladies out there, especially black women, keep talking about black don't crack, but shit, it does sog. And y'all doing too much. Embrace your grays. Embrace your crow feet. Embrace your age. You can't compete with the young girls. Yes, you're 53, and you look 53. You don't look 33. So I'm telling yourself that lie. You can put all the makeup on your face. You are 53 years old. Act like it. Next thing you know, you're going to see Mary J. Blige twerking. And if I see that, man, I'm going I'm to unfriend you, Mary J. I really am. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Trying to compete with these young girls? Stop it. You got your fan base. And you're not going to gain any more new fans trying to be a tween. Ain't no guys checking for you like that. You got your young dude. Again, if you're doing this for him, because after one or two smash, he's getting tired of it. I get that. But you're not going to get keep his attention by trying to act young, by trying to put all these add-ons. It's a straight turn-off. Sheesh. Anyway, that's my thought for the day. If you guys got any value of my content, do me a quick favor. Hit that like. Hit that subscribe. You see that notification bell? Turn on that notification bell so you get my latest and greatest. Share this content with your best friends. Tell your mama I said hi. All right, all right. Till next time, I'll see you guys again. And all you ladies with the BBLs, get off my lawn.